Hey, what's going on? Just got this package from Anthony over at Granddaddy Herbs. Granddaddy Herbs or GDH, whatever you want to call it, doesn't matter. Um, it's a female in here. And I was actually going to get a different female from him, but it turned out that that female was a male. And that's not the only time that's happened to me. I mean, mistakes happen. I'm not talking crap or anything, but I was going to get another snake from another breeder, and he did the same thing as well. So, But they both let me know that, hey... The snake that I wanted is a male, so they let me either do a refund or pick a different snake. And I kind of feel bad because this snake was actually one of his holdbacks, and I'm so. But this, she's she's really nice, and he's gonna keep two of the same morph. And I'm pretty sure you guys have seen his videos, and I'm pretty sure you guys will see what it is or remember what it is from his videos. But I kind of like this one more. He kept the one that he that had a busier pattern, and it did. It was a pretty cool pattern, but I just like this one a little bit more than his holdback, so I'm really lucky that he let me have this. So, yeah, let me open it real fast. And I do have a male for her, but she's, more, she's not going to be breeding for a long time, so, yeah. It doesn't really matter. Um, but yeah, you can see some granddaddy herbs. Pretty sure you guys seen my address, but oh, well, I'll try to try to hide it. Um, two fifty shipped, not a bad deal at all. And that's the pairing. So. So I'm pretty sure you guys can guess what that is, or what it is with the parent. But, let's take her out. off this tape. She's ready to come out. She's just over a month old. And this was one of his holdback female pastel mystics. I was gonna get one of his other pastel mystics, the one one of the ones he actually had for sale. If you guys have seen his for sale video, it's actually the first female pastel mystic. Well, it was supposed to be female, but it turned out to be a male, I guess. But it was the first pastel mystic that he showed. I was supposed to get that one, but like I said, it turned out to be a male, which mistakes happen. So he let me either choose between having a holdback, I mean not a holdback, or yeah, I guess having a holdback, or getting a refund. And I chose to get, take one of these girls. And the reason why I said yes, because otherwise I would have just been like, just give me a refund. But the only reason why I said yes was because I really have been looking for a Mystic for a while. And, I mean, she has pastel to boot, so that kind of kept me strung in. But still, just that little part right there really just, I think, is cool. But, yeah. Really nice snake. But yeah, I just want to do a quick unboxing. She's kind of cold, not too bad. And I was actually going to get a 12 quart tub for her, which maybe she could use. Oops. But she'll be good in this little 6 quart tub for a few hours. Really nice. I'm really excited for her. And that's a pastel mystic. She's just going to go to a 
pretty normal mill. Not he's not normal, but I mean, yeah, for the stuff, stuff that I just want to make, I just want to make it myself. So yeah. But that's her. Like I said, I got it from Granddaddy Herps or Anthony, whatever you know him by. And yeah. And just let her chill in the tub, put her on the heat tape. The tub's a little warm. But she needs to get back up to heat. But anyways, that's it. See ya.